All right, McLovin, are you ready with Against the Grain? Yes, sir. All right, fire up the music. Against the Grain brought to you by Red Hook. This is called Against the Rain, Dan. Or blame it on the rain, depending on how it goes. Oh, no. Go I'm ahead. Go rain on. on the parade of different teams and groups. Start with the Cleveland Browns. Feeling great, right? Listen to their schedule coming up. Detroit at Green Bay at KC, host Baltimore at Cincinnati, Steelers, and then they got a trip to the Patriots. They're going down, Dan. I hate to say it. That is about probably four losses mm-hmm. in a row. Number two, the undefeated teams. Let's say this. They're all on the road. New Orleans at Chicago. Seattle at Indy. New England against Cincinnati. Denver at Dallas. KC at Tennessee. I see three or four losses. Broncos come out unscathed and maybe one other team. All right, let's go to more groups that I am raining on their parade. How about the zero-win teams? Dan, I'll guarantee you only one zero-win team of the four wins this week. That's the Giants. Washington and Pittsburgh definitely, definitely remain in the winless column. They have buys, Dan. Just I, yeah, I know. Okay. Right. Two more here, and I'll get out of here. The Detroit Lions. For good? Yeah, did you know they go to the Packers? They have a 22-game losing streak in Wisconsin. Yeah. That ain't good. But how big is this game for the Packers? Oh, huge. Yeah, there's huge. a couple of big games. Uh, you know, Certainly the Packers... All right, and my last rain on the parade, Patrick Seton O'Connor. I'm going to rain on his parade. Now, West, in West case Virginia. you're watching, and you're not watching, McLevin has an umbrella over his head. Because I'm raining on team's parades. Our uh, cameraman, Nick, is holding an umbrella over McLevin. This is the blame it on the rain. Yeah. yeah. My last one, Patrick Seton <laughs> O'Connor. His West Virginia Mountaineers are going to be rained on by Dan Patrick and Andrew McLevin's Perloffs. Baylor Bears. This is a breakout game. Baylor's first real opponent, Bryce Petty, their quarterback. It's a 28-point spread. That's a team to watch. I know you like them a lot too, right, Dan? I, sure. All right. Well, that's against the rain. Th- thank you, McLovin. Once again, I know less than I did before it started. Uh, you got one and two Atlanta hosting the Jets on Monday night, so they should be fine. One and two Green Bay hosting Detroit. Big game at Lambeau. Cincinnati is actually a favorite over New England, barely. Uh, that's a big game, too. Big game. All five 4-0 teams on the road. Denver is at Dallas. Seattle at Indy. New Orleans at Chicago. New England will be at Cincy. Kansas City at Tennessee. How many uh, teams lose? How many teams will be uh, undefeated by uh, weekend? I think the end two. Of the weekend? I think two. Denver and... I'd lean towards New Orleans, although they're the smallest favorite. Uh, actually, New England is an underdog at Cincy. New Orleans is only a one-point favorite over Chicago. Okay. Thank you, McLovin. That's Against the Rain, brought to you by the great folks at Red Hook. The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience.